Things have come back faster than I thought. Employees are coming back faster than I thought. The economy is coming back faster than I thought. And Chicago is, it's not where it needs to be yet, but I'm very positive about where, where it is, where it's going. For our business, a client-focused business, we still need to be you know, in the office more than never. To grow our business, to get the kind of collaboration we need to win mandates and uh, figure out what our clients need, we need to be together. We also recently announced a $10 million contribution to basically be the funder uh, for the Rush BMO Health Equity Institute. That's a big deal for us. There's so many uh, people in the neighborhoods that don't have the same access to health care that we do. It's our job to understand the issues and fix them. That's critical for, what, for the business community to get around these issues, to help the political side, and to address them. And that's what's so great about Chicago. You know, I'm really proud of the pivot that we were able to make as part of the pandemic. Uh, the frontline employees, the ones out, out engaging our customers, uh, really had to reinvent their work practices and reinvent themselves uh, overnight uh, because uh, one day with unsafe gas service is one day too many. Chicago was a destination for the relocations of corporations, and it's because of that great corporate community that exists that welcome other corporations. The real strength is the attraction of the young people. Uh, we have young talent that comes to Chicago uh, that corporations clearly uh, like to come here and, and, and have to be part uh, of their team. So uh, we need to continue to leverage uh, the young people that we've attracted to, to Chicago. Thankfully, our business and professional services in general have held up strong, a lot of it because the economy has held up strongly, and it will be dependent on creating opportunities for these younger people. 75% of the people that work for us are 30 years of age or younger, and mentoring is a big part of what we do. And I think we as a firm, and I know we as a firm right now are defining, okay, what are the points where people need to come together to work together? to create those mentoring opportunities and teaching moments for the younger people in our organization? And when is it okay for them to go and work in a dispersed environment? Personally, I would like to see the business leaders in Chicago come together and work collaboratively with the governor and the mayor to help solve the issue. Just imagine the power of all the business leaders in the city working collaboratively with the governor and the mayor. I think we can overcome any obstacle if we're all working together.